This is another uh, question that came in on Facebook. And again, sometimes with these, um, these image questions, it's just easier to record a video and write on it than it is to um, take all these screenshots of it and, and write a post. And, and I, think, I think a video makes a question like this more clear, too. So let me just do this one in video as well. The figure above shows three squares. That's important that these are squares. So we know these are 5 and 5 and 5, and 7 and 7 seven and X and X and X right and X we know those things all right it might not be apparent at first but the key to this question really is that it's a slope question line L the slope of line L is what's going to reveal to us what's going on here and so note that if uh, this square has a height of five and this square has a height of seven then that little rise there is two right and then uh, we're going to call this um, I guess I'm going to call this uh, y because we've already got an x in the question. And what we know here is that the slope of line L is going to be the rise over the run. And we have a rise and a run right here. We have two fifths. Rise of two, run of five. And of course, the slope of a line is constant, and so we can use that to figure out y, right? Here we had a rise of 2 and a run of 5. Here we have a rise of y and a run of 7, but that has to be the same ratio. So I can say 2 fifths equals y over 7. And then I just do a little solving. I say 5y equals 14 and y equals 14 fifths. And that's cool, except that's not what I'm asked for yet. I want the value of x. And so the value of x is going to be 7 plus y. It's going to be 7 plus 14 fifths. 7 plus 14 fifths is going to be 35 fifths plus 14 fifths is going to be 49 fifths. That's our answer. Cool, right? I know.